I don't know about you, but have the moths been driving you crazy lately? Apparently, a lot of the people are feeling the same way about these flying insects that seem to be everywhere. Yeah, we've got them all over the place here at the station, yes. too. So when will we be free of this torment? <laughs> Kelby Kaysburg and Shavia Jordan trying to get us some answers. According to Gaffer Pest Control, this moth invasion only happens every few years, either in the spring or the fall. But the question everyone wants answered is why and how to get rid of them. I think it just due to the dryness in the area. It's a situation of flying insects, so they're, you know, we can control what's there, but they can come back. So you got to bear that in mind. The best thing for people to do is to keep everything as tight, airtight as possible so they can't come in and out. The Smithsonian Institute says there are nearly 11,000 species of moths, and the ones that seem to be taken over Lubbock are called Miller moths. Gafford says one option is to call a professional, but there is only so much they can do. We can only treat what's there because there are flying insects, so if they come back in, uh, you know, there's not much residual we can put out that's going to take care of it a little bit, but not, you know, it's going to help a little bit. It's just a situation, it's just kind of a, people just have to grin and bear until we, you know, they run, they run their cycle through and get out of, of uh, the area. Gafford says they will cycle out and be completely gone in the next few weeks. KLBK viewers shared their experiences on our Facebook saying these moths are taking over their homes, some even sharing a dish soap remedy to trap and kill them. They can't sting, bite, and they don't carry diseases, but they are annoying. Moths, uh, this, this is rather unusual. We don't have this very often, but when we do, uh, you know, it, it is a, it's a problem. It's people really, you know, irritating a lot of people around town. While you await the departure of these flying insects, you can make sure there are no openings for them to get in and keep your outdoor lights off.